Okay, now we're back. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to set up the scope to monitor our RF output and uh, take a look at our signal going out uh, from a radio here, our ICON 751. Um, and first of all, we're going to turn it on. We've had it turned on. And we're going to put it on. Uh, we're going to kill the vertical gain section, the vertical amplifier inside the scope by this switch here. You put it on ground, mon monitor, or monitor. And then we're going to adjust our sweep here so we can see our signal. Okay, we're going to make sure our tone board is in the off position here. And then our scope is going to go from uh, right here. It says uh, monitor. We've got our function switch set to monitor. And we've got our RF gain over here set to minimum. Okay. Then I want to talk into our, to our transceiver here. And I'm going to say a test signal. I'm not going out over the air. I am uh, broadcasting out on 14.254 uh, 14 or 20 meters. And we're going to take a look at the scope here and I'll adjust it up so I can see my, my signal. Uh, I'm going to broadcast in without compression first. And we're going to go testing one two three four okay I can't see anything uh, on the scope yet so uh, I'm gonna have to adjust my signal back so I can take a look at audio you gotta remember audio is not from 1k to 10k but from a probably a hundred up to 2500 so I'm gonna put it right here on the sweep and uh, let's see what happens when I flip it to that position Okay, I'm going to flip it to the 100 to 1K position and I'm going to put my variable gain here uh, approximately about right in the center and we'll see what kind of signal we have here. Okay, testing 1, 2, 3, 4, 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 1, 2, 3, 4. Testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. <clears throat> okay, I, as I go through this, you can see that on four you can see a better signal. So let me try that again. One, two, three, four, four. Okay, now I'll back down on the minimum. The RF attenuator here means that this is a minimum. This is at maximum. This will handle up to a thousand watts uh, down to uh, the minimum amount. So if I flip that switch down, you'll see that the RF signal will go down on the amplitude on the vertical on the on the scope scale. Testing one, two, three, four. 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 I kind of like it right there. That's the second step up from the minimum. I'm going to do it again. Testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. And I'm going to adjust the mic gain on my radio and you can see uh, I'm going to set it. So these uh, monitors where you can set up and monitor your output, you can set your radio exactly to get the best output. Testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. Okay, that's a minimum output now and I'm going to adjust it up so I can start. You can see that it's, it's moving up. Testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. four. Hey, I got a little sore throat there, but you can see my voice is real choppy. And you can see that the uh, what the oscilloscope is doing as you can see your voice pattern. Okay, I'll talk into that and now we're going to show you the compression on this radio. So I've got my uh, microphone gain as recommended in the uh, rules and uh, setting of, the, of my radio here. It's about at half <clears throat> at 12 o'clock position my mic gain. My power output is set to minimum so I, I'm not broadcasting out. I'm broadcasting into a dummy load right now. And I'm going to 
<clears throat> broadcast and as I broadcast or as I talk in the microphone what I'm going to do is, is set the compression so on the radio you can see what that does when you compress your signal the uh, more compressed your signal the uh, more uh, valleys it's not going to have it will go out towards the end of the wave which will give you uh, a better audio output that you can uh, have a weak signal but have good audio output uh, doing DX work they recommend in the instructions not to use the compression or a speech compression uh, switch for normal communications but if you're trying to do DX work uh, use compression all right let me talk into the microphone here and you can see okay testing one two three this is without compression now I'm gonna put compression on the uh, on the radio testing one two three four 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 one two three four one two three four one two three four okay this is going to be without compression as you can see that the uh, signal is not going out to the ends or the to the output but is not being compressed uh, the the audio is not being compressed and I'm gonna flip it on here and now you can see that the peaks are going out as far as you can and uh, broadcasting out so this is a good uh, way of showing you the compression with without compression with compression without compression with compression okay so as you can see there the signal in compression is going out and the audio will go out further this is compressed and this is without compression so you have a stronger output signal with uh, with uh, compression than you do without having compression and this is showing you how to use oscilloscope to monitor your output signal it also shows you how to set the oscilloscope this particular scope up to monitor uh, signals uh, without it's like using it as an oscilloscope okay I hope that is very informative thank you